first we need to create about first we need to know about the ERP or structure. So what is a company? Company code, a plant, and a storage locations. Then after that, we need to know about the EWMR structure. So in the EWMR structure, we need to we need to be more cautious on these creations of the warehouse numbers, storage types, storage sections, and the storage bins. So when you when we go to the implementation project, so we need to the whatever we are configuring in our system, these kind of configurations only we are going to do. But there will be slight deviations with our business processes. We need to be more accurate on them. But my sincere advice to you guys is please practice this daily. You need to have a touch with the system daily. Why? Because you people are learning right now. So if you don't log into the system for at least for one or two days, then it will be new to you guys. So to identify or to learn again. So please be in touch with the system daily and try to practice more and more scenarios but also by creating more and more compliance or anything, try to practice plies of thrice daily. So let's first come to the ERP R structure. So here we are also going to learn about the integration side as I have been told you. Here we are also going to learn about NMEM, the integration module, Smith NMEM, HD, FICO, PM, and also uh, some other like uh, Ma'am, nasty. We go. PM, go you add manager. And also, there is other EAD logistics. So these are some and and some integrations with other models. Also, we'll be trying to learn, but most probably we will be mostly consume. We will be mostly these four models will be mostly going to you guys will get uh, integrations. We'll be having an integration between MM, SD, FICO, and TM. So uh, that too, not completely, but we need to have a basic idea about these things. Why? Because whenever we are going to buy a product, first, coming to here in the ENP of structure, company, company code, plant, and the storage locations. This company and the company code operations will be taken care by the finance team. While coming to the plank, Plant will be created by the MMKIN or P2P thing. Plant and store his locations. And when coming to purchase orders or purchase requisitions, and these all details will be taken care by the NM or a P2P thing. So we need to be known about the MM and also the creation of the company, company code, and also the financial account related details. That will be taken care of by the finance team FICO. So we need to be know about the those details. And while coming to the SD, for our business, we don't only buy the products, we also sell the products. So to sell the products, we require a sales product. So for this, we require an SD team. So sales and distribution. So they will sell the products. And the PM. PM module, whenever we are receiving the products, we will receive the products to a vehicle at some kind of vehicle like trucks or auto or whatever the vehicle. So how do they are going to receive this? In which vehicle we are going to receive the product? Basic integration of TM, transportation management, we will be going to learn on this. And also the ad logistics. So inside our warehouse, how at making most that is nothing but ad management so that also will be trying to cover in this in the never awm sessions and now coming to company here of structure company company core a plant and as to his location 